Good morning, y'all. Today I'm showing you my slow morning routine for the mornings I want to start my day relaxed and stress free. So I'm waking up at 8 a.m. This is honestly a little early for me, but I was filming, so I needed some extra time. I usually let my body wake up naturally, and that's been between like 9:45 and 10 a.m. lately. So I'm definitely a night owl, but I try to wake up well before 12 to make sure I get the most out of the sun and daylight. I'm gonna hang out in my bed for a while this morning. I want to wake up my mind and body very slowly so I'm just gonna write in my five minute journal and read a few pages of the book I'm currently reading I hadn't read for fun since middle school to be honest and I've recently picked it back up and bought a few books mostly I like fiction but I'm trying to get into self-help so if you guys have some recommendations besides the alchemist and the four agreements then please comment them I'm just making sure I'm staying hydrated and now I'm going to answer some emails, watch TikTok, and listen to music, really just taking my time and not putting too much stress on jumping out of bed and rushing, you know, into my responsibilities and things like that. But I don't want to stay in bed all day, so I only lay here for like an hour max. I also want to plan out my day and make a small to-do list of things I need to get done. And I always drink water in the morning before I eat or drink anything. So I'm making this detox water I saw on TikTok. It's just water, lemon, and two tablespoons of chia seeds. You let it sit, I think, 10 minutes and then drink it. It just tastes like lemon water, but the way the seeds look honestly make me itch. So I try to drink it as fast as possible. But other than that, it's not nasty at all. It's literally just lemon water with texture. So next, I'm going to take my vitamins. I'm just taking a multivitamin and a probiotic. These are just my essentials. I don't really take too many. And I love candles so much. They create such a relaxing vibe. And I like when my house smells good. So I light all the candles in each room before I do my hygiene routine. So for hygiene, you guys have seen me do a lot of this stuff. But I'm going to brush my teeth and then use my Proxa brushes in between my brackets. And then go in with some mouthwash. And I wanted to give my skin a break from the acids and chemicals I've been using. So I kept it easy today. I'm just using a gentle cleanser on my face and a couple moisturizers, eye cream, and like hyaluronic acid for my skincare. And for body care, I'm just using an unscented body wash and a natural oil and body butter. And then I'm going to go in with an SPF oil to protect my skin. Now I'm going to get dressed in something very comfy today. I just chose a zip up and a jumpsuit, but I changed into sweatpants later. And I find that I have a better day if I put some sort of effort into my appearance. So I'm just doing an easy style on my hair. And that does bring us to today's sponsor. Thank you so much, Merit, for working with me on today's video. I love doing my makeup even on lazy days because I never know when I might have to leave my apartment and I want to look presentable when I do and it just makes me feel good. So I don't want to do heavy makeup all the time so Merit is perfect because they use skin loving ingredients and all of their products are very lightweight on the skin making it perfect for everyday makeup. So I first went in with the Minimalist which is a perfecting complexion stick and these can be used as foundation or concealer and they blended in so nicely into my skin and felt like I was wearing nothing and a lot of Merit's products are perfect for on the go you can throw these in your purse and touch up your makeup later and I also went in with their flush balm cheek tint in the shade Beverly Hills to give my cheekbones some lift and now I'm using the day glow which is a dewy highlighting balm and it's so perfect for a natural look because there aren't any sparkles so it gives you a really natural shine and glow so after blending everything into my skin, I'm going in with a clean lash lengthening mascara. The formula is really nourishing and it stayed on all day. Then I'm going back in with the blush and I'm using it on my lips to give them a really nice natural pink shade. And then I'm going to set that into place with the signature lip in the shade Baby. It's so cute. It's also a pinky nude. And I absolutely loved Merit's lip oil. This was the best pigment I've seen in the lip oil and it's very lightweight but you still have a lip gloss type of look so this is my minimal face for today thank you so much Merit for sponsoring today's video I will have all of their info linked in the description box down below so make sure you guys check them out so by now I'm starving I usually eat pretty late every day um, so I'm gonna make myself a quick breakfast and I love having bagels in the morning so 
I am just gonna make a bagel sandwich with eggs, turkey bacon, cheese, spinach, and put some hot sauce on it. It's really easy and very good. Like you don't have to be a chef to make it. It's gonna taste good every single time. So if you want it to be more healthy, you can always switch out the everything bagel for a whole wheat bagel and take off the cheese and just use egg whites. But me, I want everything on it. So I'm just putting it all together and then I'm also gonna pour some orange juice and while I eat I'm gonna be taking care of a few things I need to do today just really easy things like answering emails responding to texts and doing some shopping I like to put really easy tasks on my to-do list just so I feel like I'm still accomplishing something even if I'm you know choosing to take my morning slow and not really take care of like really stressful responsibilities I have so after I eat I'm just gonna cross off anything from my to-do list um, and it just makes me feel good and it motivates me to keep going for the rest of the day um, just knowing I'm at least getting you know simple things done after I eat I'm gonna straighten up a little bit in the kitchen I'm not doing any deep cleaning because that honestly stresses me out, but I also don't wanna leave it a mess because that'll stress me out even more. So I'm just wiping down the counters, rinsing off the dishes that I used, and just, you know, light work. After cleaning, I'm gonna make some coffee, and I don't like to drink coffee on an empty stomach, so I usually have it later in the day, and it's more of a treat for me since I put a lot of sugar in it, so I also don't drink coffee every single day. Um, I usually stick to water and if I want juice I just drink orange juice so this morning is all about relaxing so I'm just gonna relax and enjoy my coffee I would do it outside and you know get some sunlight but I do not like bugs and in Texas there are a lot of bugs so luckily my apartment does get a lot of natural light in it so I'm just gonna sit and enjoy you know the scenery the view and just chill so next, I'm just going to open some packages I had delivered. Um, some of them are for work, and then I had some clothes, and then I also got a new lens. So hopefully my video quality is going to be a little better in the next upcoming videos. And I don't know if y'all noticed, but I didn't make my bed, and that's because I'm getting right back in, and I'm going to put on some more YouTube. And I'm just going to spend as much time as possible alone and just enjoying myself and start my day whenever I want to. I'm not going to be too hard on myself because that can easily overwhelm me. So yeah, this was my lazy morning routine, perfect for weekends or when you just want to wake up slowly and do your own thing. So I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching. I hope y'all enjoyed and I will see you in the next video.